Well, Happy New Year. Merry Christmas. Merry Kwanzaa. Hope everybody's doing great this new year. It is the first challenge that I'm filming in the year of 2022, which hopefully is going to be a little bit better than the last couple of years. So I figured I'd start it off with a good old classic, just a giant tower of friggin' donuts. Because donuts are delicious, why not? All right, so what I've got in front of me is a four and a half dozen of Franz donuts. Got three packages of their uh, powdered donuts filled with raspberry sauce, three packages of their original donuts, and three packages of their lemon donuts. So a bunch of classics. All right, without any more stalling, I'm gonna jump right into it. Uh, of course, we're gonna give the old timer a turn. I'm gonna see how many of these donuts I can get through uh, before this sand all falls to the bottom of my timer. Oh, and of course, got my little dish of milk that I can dunk some donuts into if I want to, and a nice refreshing uh, effervescent lime flavored beverage. Unsweetened, because we gotta watch the calories. All right, now that's all. Now that that's all out of the way, let's start. Let's uh, start by eating some donuts. Mm. Good lime fla uh, lemon flavored donut to start with. Oh yeah, kicking off the new year with a giant pile of donuts. This is another classic that I'm bringing back from the past. It seems like once every couple of months, maybe once a year. I'll just make a big tower of donuts and see how many I can eat. So this time around, we're starting off 2022 with a pile of Franz donuts. And before I go any further, I would like to remind you guys that this is a small channel. And I know that uh, most people who watch these videos are not subscribers. And what is the deal with that? Do yourselves a solid in the new year and hit that subscribe button. It does really help me out a lot. I know I say it a lot, but uh, that's because it's true. All right, back to the donuts. I need you guys to pipe up in the comments. Tell me what is your favorite kind of convenience donuts? Do you like Franz? Do you like Entenmann's? Do you like Hostess? Is there another brand that I'm completely forgetting? You guys got to let me know. I know that uh, they don't get a whole lot of love, but uh, I do think that these Franz glazed donuts are pretty, they, yeah, they're pretty good. They're not too bad. Uh, they're nice and hearty, nice and sweet, got a lot of flavor in them. I especially love the tanginess of those lemon donuts. I mean, it's hard to go wrong with something like that. Oh. Man, I forgot how good these softies are. Mm. Filled with that nice raspberry cream. I mean, it's hard to go wrong with bread and sugar, covered in sugar, <laughs> filled with liquid sugar. <laughs> yeah, it's a toss up between whether the old fashioned donuts or the, what I call softies are better. Uh, the kind of like cakey donuts. I think it's really just uh, depends on what day it is. You know, sometimes you want something that's really hearty with a little bit of chew to it. So you go for one of those uh, more dense, uh, old fashioned donuts. And sometimes you just want something super soft. So that's when you'd go for the uh, cake donuts. I do like that the cake donuts have that raspberry filling. Again, gives it a little bit of a tart flavor to it. Not just pure sweet, gives a little bit of complexity. You know, I like to think that I'm uh, all hoity-toity and sophisticated eating my raspberry filled donut. Mm. So who thinks that they could eat all of these donuts in a single sitting? If you think you can, let me know. I challenge you to give it a shot. I mean, donuts are a universally liked food. Some people like to say that uh, their tastes make them unique, but I don't know of anyone who doesn't like donuts. I mean, they're just so good. All 
I mean, you absolutely cannot beat a fresh donut. These prepackaged ones, they'll, they'll do the trick in a pinch. <laughs> One of the differences about them, though, is that they are so dense. <laughs> they are so heavy. They don't really absorb water too well. I always like that fresh donuts really pick up a lot of milk when you dunk them. Not so much with these prepackaged ones, though. <laughs> I think they are what you would call a short dough, perhaps. That is absolutely true. If you're looking for something that's easy to eat quickly, something for an eating contest, if you will, then those prepackaged old fashioned donuts are definitely not the ones to go for. A nice fresh yeast risen donut uh, picks up a lot more milk, makes it a lot easier to eat really quickly but uh, I'm just here to eat as many donuts as I can, not really worrying about eating too fast. Off with the hat, because one thing about eating all this food is that it does increase the metabolism when you eat a bunch of sugar like this, a bunch of sugar and calories. Your body's like, hey, look at all this energy that's coming in, we gotta burn it off. And uh, it does warm up the body quite a bit. So yeah, New Year's res resolution, need to lose some weight, make sure you eat more food, then you'll increase your uh, metabolism. That's how that works, right? So New Year's resolution for me, eat lots and lots of food, work out, burn off all those calories, and uh, try to be awesome. That's about it for my New Year's resolutions. I hope you guys are enjoying the video. I'm going to let you watch the rest of it without listening to me yap on. And until next time, I'll catch you guys later. <sighs> oh my gosh. Guys, this is a lot of donuts. <laughs> I don't know why this is a revelation to me just now, but it really is a lot of donuts. <laughs>
to work those donuts down into the torso. <laughs> Oh. oh my goodness. <clears throat> Only one dozen donuts left to go. <laughs> Just one dozen wee tiny little donuts. <laughs> God. Oh, I think I'm gonna call it quits there, guys. <laughs> just a few donuts shy of finishing, but my camera's just about done. I hope you guys got a kick out of that. Four dozen donuts, not quite the four and a half dozens, but oh, oh my gosh. <laughs> All right, until next time, I hope you guys have a good one. <laughs>